So with Valentine's Day just hours away, our Erin Subula found the time to cook up something romantic and delicious without breaking the bank. Author and chef Leslie Stowe is going to show us how to woo your special someone creatively. Our own Erin Sebula got a tasty lesson on how to show your love on a budget, you make it yourself. Okay, so what kind of decadent, sexy treats are we going to make? Well, brownies, which are like the ultimate. Don't forget to garnish the plate. This easy cutout can also be made more personal by using the initials of your loved one. That looks gorgeous. This is what Valentine's Day is all about. Yeah, absolutely. Your hands are dirty, yeah. chocolate. Throw in some strawberry marshmallows. This is where, like, could be dangerous. Well, or it could be really fun for Valentine's yeah. Day, right? If you have the two of you in the kitchen yep. making marshmallows. Our marshmallows are set, so now we're going to do something fun again with the heart shape and get some great ribbon. Or if you're going to someone's house and instead of having um, a chocolate dessert, you want to do something decadent, you take something like this amazing cake plate. And a nice cup of hot cocoa. No, now with the strawberry marshmallows on top, how good does that get? Finally, for that personal touch, a homemade card. We've done one card here with the K, so you take it and, you know, just make your own little things. Kiss me, this says. And last but not least, flowers. Go with one color tone. Like, say, just do, do white, and you do all kinds of different flowers, but all white. And when it's all said and done, a do-it-yourself Valentine's will only set you back between $10 and $15.